Carlos Massa. Charles Celando Massa Dai is born September 24, 1971, best known as Carlos Massa, is a Colombian former professional boxer who competed from 2000 to 2007 and held the WBA Super Light Welterweight title in 2005. Professional career Turning pro in 2000 at the age of 29, Massa won two titles and fought in several significant fights until his retirement at age 38. Massa was raised in the Santa Fe neighborhood of Menteria, a city located in the banks of the Sinu River, where he began his impressive amateur career, which ultimately brought him just nine defeats in 130 bouts. Massa was named national champion four times and was also crowned the Central American champion. He gained the nickname the Apostle by his frequent preaching of the Christian gospel. In his professional career, while never a superstar fighter, he was a highly touted gatekeeper who helped define the careers of several light welterweight prospects. Notable Fights S -s -s Massa began his career with 12 victories in his native Colombia before coming to the United States. He then won four bouts in the U.S. before facing highly touted New York prospect Jeffrey Risto, described as perhaps the most talked about young pro in New York. In this battle of two undefeated fighters, 17-0 Risto vs. 16-0 Massa, Risto was unable to deal with Massa's unorthodox fighting style and abruptly quit in the sixth round, earning Massa an unexpected victory. Both fighters' careers ended half a decade later with a loss to the same fighter, Victor Ortiz. Massa's win over Risto earned him a shot at fellow 17-0 boxer and WBC international light welterweight title holder Miel Angel Cato. Massa's fight against Cato was less successful, resulting in Cato winning by an eighth-round TKO. Following this, Massa fought in three lower-profile fights, winning two. Then, on 25 June 2005, this exciting victory made Massa a new champion in one of boxing's competitive divisions. The bout was notable for a number of reasons. Harris was an overwhelming favorite and is regarded as one of the best boxers at the weight and Massa's awkwardly clever style and frequent clowning gestures and facial expressions lent him an air of amateurishness. At the beginning of the seventh round, Massa delivered a stunning left hook, KOing Harris. Massa then lunged downward, and punched him in the head while he was already supine on the canvas. The ropes absorbed the impact of the blow. Still, this act has led to much controversy, as the hit could have disqualified Massa. After the match, however, the bout referees ruled that the late hit was insignificant, allowing Massa to keep his title. When interviewed about this punch, Massa claimed he didn't connect with Harris on purpose, and that his sole intention was to impress the fallen Harris in case he had any desire to fight on. The victory cemented Massa's reputation as somewhat of a gatekeeper for up-and-coming light welterweight prospects, but ended up being his last victory. On 26 November 2005, Massa lost his WBA title against IBF title holder, Ricky Hatton, in a unification bout. After a unanimous decision loss to Manuel Guanica, Massa fought well-regarded future title holder Victor Ortiz and was knocked out in the first round. Following this, Massa retired with a professional record of 20 wins and 5 losses in a total of 113 professional rounds of boxing. Professional Boxing Record